Ron Shelton here on the Rich Eisen Show. All right, let's 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 have a little bit of fun here if you're uh, up for it, even though I haven't told you about it, so hopefully you are up for it. We have two characters from four of your films, including Bull Durham, where now everything, there's the, you know there's sequel mania once again, certainly with Top Gun Maverick making a billion dollars worldwide. I'm wondering if we, we, I'll give you two characters. You tell me where you think they are today. Off the top of your head, Ron Shelton. Yep. Okay, we're going to start with uh, from the film uh, Bull Durham, as we've just discussed. Where Where is Crash Davis today, would you think? Crash Davis uh, got a, went to the minor, started in Visalia as mm-hmm. a manager. Mm-hmm. And he's worked his way up and it's taken him all these years. And Durham is now a AAA town. Mm-hmm. So he's worked his way up to Durham, which used to be a gateway to oblivion, and now it's possibly the gateway to the big leagues. Mm-hmm. So he's on the verge of actually getting to the big leagues as a manager. And that's how we, we find Crash Davis right yes. now. Yes, there's other, there's other things. Okay. Annie. Where's New, it, it, is Annie still with her right now? Well, it, it, didn't, it, didn't, it didn't work out. I, I, I outlined in the, in, in, in the afterword of the book yes. the outline for the sequel I once had that didn't happen. Okay. And everybody's too old now, but... Yeah, after they carry it, it didn't work because she's not going to travel around being the supportive wife of, a, right. you know, Snitker's wife or whatever. And I, and I love I love Brian Snitker. But, By the way, that's a great, like, that, so, that sounds like a, a rejected Neil Simon movie, right? The <laughs> Snitker's, Snitker's wife. wife. Snitker's wife. All right. Well, she's sorry, an angel. But, All those wives right. are angels. Sure, right. Yeah. I mean, uh-huh. Andy Reid's wife. Jesus. What they. Right. So, um, and I, I love Snitker and I love Andy Reid, so I can use their wives. Sure, and, yeah. And, and, um, so so uh, it doesn't work because she can't do that. So she ends up teaching in the Sorbonne in Paris <laughs> as an expert on Edith Piaf. The singer. The okay. great singer who she's always playing in her house. That's in right, movie. that's right. Well, who? and she's like the legendary French singer. But who is... Susan, really an expert on about Piaf's life. Who is Piaf's love, big love? Marcel Sardin, the, the middleweight boxing champion. Mm-hmm. There's movies been made about this, mm-hmm. that her love was an athlete, Piaf's. So she falls in love, she thinks, with a French director, but she doesn't realize that it's not real love until she goes back to teach one year at Duke University. Ah. <sighs> And runs into manager the manager crash. crash. So where has Nuke been? Yes, that's He's, the next one. He, yes, Nuke's been in Venezuela working on a knuckleball. <laughs> 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 and he hasn't even noticed that the country's gone to hell. <laughs> and who discovers him down there? Well, Robert Wool never gets to the big leagues as pitching coach. Yes. Larry Hockett. He ends up being a scout, which is the worst job in the world. And he ends up in, in Latin America, where at least you find great players, in Venezuela, but there's no economy, so he's living in, a, uh-huh. in his car. And he discovers Nuke with a pretty good Jim Bouton, you know, knuckleball. And they're reunited, and he manages. He calls the big club and says, look, there's always room for a knuckleball. I, believe me, you, this guy, first-round draft pick. This month. So where does he go? Goes to Durham. And they're all reunited. Oh, wow. That's a movie that'll be, never get made. Oh, sequel, man. No, I'm, I'm all in. Let's get the time sequel, machine. Man.